for having me. Yeah. I have two questions, and uh, I guess in a way that they're related. For sure. My first one is overcoming addiction. In many ways, in something small or something big. We don't want you to overcome addiction. Next. <laughs> well, we want you to be hooked on source. We want you to be hooked on your vortex. We want you to be addicted to feeling good. We want the momentum of connection to be so strong that like our friend is talking about when she is counseling someone at her church, they can't take her down because she's so well connected. And so the word addiction often has a negative connotation, but instead of the word addiction, let's use the word momentum. And then let's talk about in which direction the momentum is pointed. And let's acknowledge that there are things that you want momentum about and maybe some things you don't want moment want momentum about but the addiction itself is not a bad thing momentum in the law of attraction is a good thing because you have the power of focusing it towards something that benefits you yes that's my second question <laughs> yes. so, so I've been listening to you since I was 12 years old and I'm not that old I'm uh, 19 so about 2012 and uh, it's been up and down since then, but I have the feeling that more recently I have a lot of momentum going the other way. Do you For have sure. a, a nugget of um, wisdom to, to reverse it? I know you talked about the, the sticks and just leaving alone what you, th what you don't associate positivity with. What we said earlier was really for you. This is good. This will help. Let's call any habit of thought or belief that doesn't serve me let's call it an addiction in other words law of attraction has got me addicted to this because law of attraction says that which is likened to itself is drawn so if I'm focusing in a way that doesn't feel good it's likely that I'm going to keep doing that unless I find some way of stopping that resistance long enough. And the best analogy that we've ever found about that is imagine a cork bobbing on the surface of the water. And let's call that alignment with source. Now you can hold that cork under the water temporarily. And let's call that negative emotion or negative attraction let's even call it addiction to something unwanted but when you let go of it it's going to bob right back up because the natural state is alignment the unnatural state doesn't feel good that's why feeling good feels good and not feeling good doesn't feel good it's because the natural state is feeling good so you want to talk about the specifics of this addiction it's kind of on a small scale but I see it around me in in bigger scales um. then let's talk about it in general at first everyone wants to feel good everything that everyone thinks they want is because they believe they will feel better when they get that and so there are a lot of people who life is doing its work just the way they knew it would life and its contrast is stimulating people to wanting more so people all over the place are launching rocket after rocket after rocket of desire and they're building these vibrational realities we call it the vortex where their inner being is standing that are calling them so everyone you know is being called toward what they want but they're standing in different places well when you're being called towards something you want by an inner being who never lets go of awareness of what you want and never stops calling you and you are standing in beliefs that aren't letting you go it's miserable and for some people because they don't know how to let go of those beliefs all they can figure out to do is to numb themselves to do something that keeps them from focusing so strongly so some drug or alcohol or something of that nature is that the subject that you want to talk about it's not that but I'm sure it applies to a lot of people and I'm sure the process is the same doesn't matter what it is they utilize some substance or some experience to cover their emotion of discord doesn't cause the discord to go away it just keeps them from feeling it while they're doing that so while there is a physiological effect of substances we don't want to get too distracted while there is a physiological effect of substances the vibrational effect is by far the greater one we know this for sure 
anything that a person feels they are addicted to which usually by that they mean something that they think isn't good for them that they keep feeling compelled to participate in if they would go just three days without putting it into their body their cellular addiction would stop completely in three days no matter how drastic the drug or whatever it is is three days is all that it takes for that to work itself through the physiology of a physical apparatus three days and the cellular calling would stop but it's not the cellular calling it's the vibrational calling it's the thoughts that they have against themselves that they are trying to numb it's the not enoughness it's the not being loved it's the not liking who I am it's the departure from their own inner being that has got them suffering and they're suffering thought by thought by thought by thought because most people have given over to what other people think about them instead of paying attention to what their inner being thinks about them so they're asking people whose job it isn't to notice them to hold them as steady attention and they're asking people who aren't tuned in tapped in turned on to be the one that helps them into that place which isn't possible either so once you get hold of this once you understand where your true resources are and you find a way to touch them every now and again so that you consciously know what it feels like to touch them and to feel them and to experience the effect of them then you get addicted to so much so that even though you're going to leave the house at four o'clock in the morning you're going to make sure that you get up and have that time of alignment because you know the difference the day will be if you take the time to find your true alignment first yeah did we get there or is there something more for that topic yeah that's that you answered my question